During a morning session, Buganda Road Chief Magistrate Arali Muhira put on hold proceedings on the second charge against Uganda People's Congress Party President Olara Wotunu. He refused to honor police summons to answer to claims that he had defamed President Yoweri Museveni on a radio station in Lira District in 2010. He later petitioned the Constitutional Court, challenging the summons issued under Section 27A of the Police Amendment Act. They must have now summoned me about six times, and on each occasion I said I've never turned up at CID headquarters to be interrogated. Huh? And in 2010, I took the matter to the Constitutional Court. The lower court therefore put the proceedings on hold until the Constitutional Court disposes of Otunu's petition. Chief Magistrate Muhira based his decision on the 2011 Supreme Court ruling on the authority of the Onyango Obo and Andrew Mwenda versus the Attorney General. But Otunu will remain battling the charge of libel the state filed against him. After mention, hearing will begin next month. Otuno's lawyer, Asman Basalira, said they are ready to proceed on the libel charge. We made an application to stop the proceedings under Section 27A because Ambassador Otunu has challenged the constitutionality of Section 27A before the Constitutional Court. There is already a constitutional petition, Ambassador Olar Otunu versus Attorney General. It is constitutional petition number two. Of 2010. Prosecution says that on 16th January 2013, Otunu, while addressing a media conference at the UPC party headquarters on Uganda House, maligned the person of President Yoweri Museveni by making defamatory remarks. He allegedly accused the president's regime of killing political opponents and regime insiders who are developing contrary political views. The UPC president was summoned on 28th February and he did not honor to the summons. Otunu denied all the charges. Court will continue with the proceedings on the libel charge on 20th August. Baker Zena, NBS Television.